really big news, and finally I get to tell you about it. Yay! So the big news is that I'm pregnant. <laughs> okay, now we got that joke out of the way. I'm not pregnant. Mm, no, definitely not pregnant. But I am gonna do something that probably will make me gain as much weight as if I was pregnant because I'm moving back to the States. I'm gonna co-host a YouTube channel called Tested together with Norm Chan and Adam Savage. And for those of you who haven't watched Tested, it's all about exploring technology and building different cool things. And Adam and I just finished our first built together. I got the idea when I was having breakfast and I was thinking about beer helmets because what else should you think about when you're having breakfast? And I thought like beer helmets are cool and all, but why isn't there a popcorn helmet? Cue the drums. The Ta-da! Ah. Sorry. I'm, really, I'm, I'm sorry. I think this might be the best project I've ever built. Because if, if you're watching a movie, you still have to like put your own hand into the popcorn bowl and, and feed yourself. And you don't wanna do that because we live in the future. And also if you're watching the movie with your friends, they're also gonna put their hands into the bowl. And, and I prefer my popcorn, like my anus, untouched by other people. So I built this popcorn helmet with Adam. I feel freaking awesome when I wear it. It's just, it's like instant good day. Let's find an extension cord up so we can watch it working. It doesn't have any popcorn in it right now because I'm really tired of cleaning up popcorn. I must stop building machines that are so messy because I'm tired of cleaning after myself. <laughs> I have nothing smart to say about this. Um, <sighs> it just can't be a bad day when you're wearing that. So this helmet actually used to be a beer helmet, but I replaced the beer cans with these popcorn containers and they have like a trap door in the bottom. So it dispenses popcorn and then it feeds it to you. Now Adam designed the hands and this like twisting mechanism. I mean, you don't want to have to eat the popcorn from a hand that's like this. And it just works freaking amazing. Look at that. And in between the helmet and these popcorn containers, I have this aluminum frame. It's called Actobotics, and I've talked about it before because I've used it for almost every project that I've built. It's just like the standard that makes it really easy to connect motors and stuff like that, and it just works like a charm. The expression works like a charm is really weird because charms don't tend to work at all. The Actobotics doesn't work like a charm. Clear communication. Good job, Simone. You can't see that, can you? I don't want to have to carry this tough life. Wow, I, I feel smart. So this entire joining tested thing is huge for me. Basically, they had seen my videos and they were like, hey, do you wanna come and build stuff with us? And I was like, hey, let me think about it. Okay, I'm done thinking about it, let's do it. The internet is a magical place. It really is. And I've been wanting to tell you about just how weird it's been to go viral in the way that I have. But I, I don't know how to tell the story because I feel like I'm still just in the beginning of it. I would just really want to thank, huh, here's something I never thought I would say. I would just really want to thank Reddit and especially the people at slash r slash shitty robots because that's just kind of where it started taking off for me. Oh gosh, this is getting cheesy. But seriously, like I always thought it was so corny when people were like, oh, I just really want to thank my fans, blah, 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 blah. I don't know how to say this. 
The last six months have just been crazy and I've gotten to do things I never thought I would get to do and it's really all because of you. Thank you so much for following me and for supporting me and for all the like super sweet things you're writing me. Seriously, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Okay, I got it out. Oh, I almost forgot. Uh, I posted a photo on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram and I asked you to guess what it was and if somebody guessed it correctly, I would draw them a manatee. And that was a very bad idea on my behalf because I have drawn more manatees than in my entire previous lifetime. The thing in the photo was a popcorn hot air popper. The initial idea was that we were going to have one on each side and the popcorn helmet was going to pop the popcorn too. But we scrapped that. I'm not very good at drawing. But here's a manatee for Mark Swope. And one for Tom Harrington, Maxa N. Yamasaki, Philip Albertson. You get a manatee. You get a manatee. Everybody gets the manatee. Simone has to draw a ton of manatees. I can't imagine that anybody would want these, but if you actually do want these, just email me your address and I'll send them your way. If you want to see a video of the full build process of the popcorn helmet, head to test it. There's a link in the description. I'm still waiting for my visa, but hopefully I can move to San Francisco within the next one or two months. So there's going to be a lot more of me on test it after that. And also, I'm, I'm, I'm still going to post stuff to my own YouTube channel. I promise. And hopefully I can get you some really cool like behind the scenes videos and other fun stuff. Okay, bye bye! Da 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 For those of you who don't know, Adam, uh, it's very late at night.